fail to harness the power. No matter how many prayers of those foolish masses come together. What the? It's a demon lord's duty to punish him. What better way is there for a finale as a trickster? Joker, we're entrusting our strength and the people's hopes to you. Put an end to this! Gone. Preposterous! You dare wrong the people's wishes! Ain't that a treasure? Right, Mona? Thanks for everything. Mona chan? Thanks for everything, gang. Thanks for everything, gang. Mona? Humans have the power to change the world. They just forgot about that a bit. Hey. Thanks to you guys, I was able to complete my duty. Everything was thanks to you, wasn't it, Morgana?
I got to be useful for humans that I admired so much. Nothing could make me happier. This place will soon disappear, too. Time to go home. The hell? What is this? Like the rain stopped. Hey guys, huh? Everything. The whole world is a product of cognition, not just the metaverse. It can be freely remade. The same goes for you and everyone else. <laughs> Dude, Mona! Mona this can't be happening! <laughs> Soon a new world will come. One where mankind isn't held captive. The world will shine brightly as long as you hold hope in your hearts. But what's going to happen to you? Remember, there's no such thing as the real world. What each person sees and feels, those are what shape reality. This is what gives the world infinite potential. Even if you feel that only darkness lies ahead, as long as you hold hands together, see it through as one, the world will never end. The world exists within all of you. Morgana... Huh... Mona... The Metanav... It's gone! The Mentos must have disappeared too... We can't see Mona anymore... Can we? It's fine... I already know... What are y'all so gloomy for? Mona would laugh at us for it. That reminds me. And what about the public? Were we able to change their hearts? I'm gonna be late for my date! All alone on Christmas, huh? It's kinda hard to tell. Aren't we going into the new year without a prime minister? Will this country be alright? <laughs> but there's no way we're getting Shido. There are tons of shady rumors about him, you know? I wonder how things will go. I hope they go well. Let's believe in the adults. Sis promised us, after all. From here on out, it's the prosecutor's job, huh? If we can't enter the metaverse, that means we've been relieved of being phantom thieves. It feels a bit sad. <sighs> what did I just say? We gotta stop being so gloomy. Think about that insane ass we just kicked. You were right. We should be celebrating with a victory toast. Well, we're still high schoolers, so we can't really drink a real toast. Oh, what if we tried something else? Like, what do athletes do after a win? You mean a huddle? We could all circle up and give a victory shout together. Sounds good. 
Except for the part where we're in the dead center of Shibuya, surrounded by tons of people. What? You want to do it here and now? Come on, Ryuji, get with the program. I too am disappointed. After all we've been through together, you've nothing left to lose with this. Hey, speak for yourself. I've got tons of shit I could lose. Fine, let's get this over with. Everyone, put your hands in. Don't you think this is a little too overt? Yeah, uh, can we hurry this up? I don't mind yelling, so long as we make it quick. Well, the celebration's going great. <sighs> Whatever. Joker, you lead off with this. Hmm. It would only feel natural for you to take the charge. When he gives our victory cry, we all follow with a super loud, Yeah! Got it? All right. One, two... made me feel a bit better it's like everything's finally over you may be right there the more I think about it the more pressure I realize we were really under I hope we can relax at least a little now Ugh, it's chilly it's snowing no wonder it's cold is this what they call a white Christmas it's still Christmas Eve Christmas. I completely forgot about it. Anyhow, we'll have to see what happens for now. We should probably break for today. Let's meet at LeBlanc tomorrow, and have a final meeting on the situation. Yeah, let's do that. Hey! It'll be Christmas, so why don't we do a last celebration party? I like the sound of that. There better not be anyone that's got plans already. Settled then. Make sure you persuade Boss to let us reserve the store for the party. We will be counting on you. Well then, see you all again tomorrow. I'm worried about Sojiro, so I'm gonna head home. <sighs> we should go home too. I didn't expect to find the world's savior alone on Christmas Eve. Can I talk to you for a minute? First off, thank you for taking my request. With your actions, I can only hope that public opinion changes. It will change, won't it? I believe so too. Shido confessed to a variety of crimes. We can arrest him on those charges. The problem lies in proving him guilty. It'd be difficult unless the correlation between the metaverse and the mental shutdowns is made. I'll be blunt. I want you to turn yourself in to the police. Your testimony will be necessary in order to prove Shido guilty. However... That will mean placing you on center stage. You'll be treated as a hero who saved this country, but there's no way that the police or the public prosecutors will let that slide. If you turn yourself into the police, you'll definitely be arrested. I'll close all the cases surrounding Shido. I intend to expose them all. It's to prevent society from becoming distorted again. That's what you want too, isn't it? you once more. 
I'd like for you to turn yourself into the police, of your own accord. There's no need for that. You... If they get their hands on the perpetrator, there'll be no need for him to turn himself in, no? If they get their hands on the perpetrator, there'll be no need for him to turn himself in, no? That appears to be the case. You said there's no need. Just what do you mean by that? Exactly as it sounds. I'll agree to testify against Shido and his crimes. I assume that works for you? You're overthinking this. I have no hidden agenda at this point. If I had to explain myself, I'd say it's simply personal principle that I repay my debts. For the time being, at least, I'll take your word that you'll cooperate with the investigation. That would save a lot of time. I'm sorry. You can forget everything I just told you. I'll take them in myself. I won't try to claim that everything will turn out perfectly for you, but I would bet this case will reach its natural conclusion. No, in fact, I swear that this will be properly settled. There you are. It gets so crowded on Christmas Eve. I know this was kind of out of the blue. You sure I'm not stepping on any other plans? Oh my gosh, what a caring master. Becky's such a lucky girl. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Seriously though, I am glad to hear it. By the way, are you hungry? Maybe we could go grab a bite somewhere? It's Christmas Eve, we should make the most of it. And don't worry about the cost, okay? I'm the working adult here, I'll cover it. Cool, let's go then. Something wrong? Oh, I see how it is. You're looking to hold hands, huh? No, I get it. Christmas Eve, walking with your sweetheart, hands locked together. It's really sweet, but not this time. You know, someone might see us. Oh, what? Oh, enough with the puppy dog eyes. You're making me feel like a monster. Well... We can't let anyone see us, so just for a little bit, okay? So much for having it covered. You'd think at least one place would have a spot open. Hey, you can't just launch into the sweet talk. Actually, forget that. Tell me more. Anyhow, if dinner's off the table, we can at least get a cake. An actual Christmassy one, too. Hey, that looks like a little cake shop. Let's go check it out. 
They might be sold out too. Oh, what the hell, I'm just gonna go for it. You never know. Excuse me, do you have any Christmas cakes left? Actually, we do! Yeah, I figured. Wait, what? One of our orders was cancelled last minute. This is the only cake we have. Whoa, seriously? Well, in that case... Yeah, we'd love to buy it. Of course! Just wait one moment while I go prepare your order. Well, that's a surprise. We really got lucky, huh? Oh my god! You went to all that trouble for little old Becky? <laughs> yeah, no, I highly doubt that. Anyhow, let's get this miracle cake out of here and go enjoy our evening. This is delicious. I think it's been years since the last time I got to actually enjoy cake. Pretty smooth, but... Those lines don't work the best when you've got cream on your nose. It reminds me you're still the younger one here and how I should be looking out for you as the adult. But somehow, I always end up running to you for help. Honestly, I really don't like that you keep putting yourself in danger. Why does it have to be you? Still, I can't get mad at you for following your heart. It's the only reason I got my life back. So, thank you. Really. And congratulations on everything you've accomplished, too. I owe you a lot. Not just because of the Phantom Thieves' work, but what you've done for me. You helped me remember what I really wanted to do with my life. That's why I got you a little something. Here. It's a pretty good pen case, so it'll be good for school, right? You can carry it with you, and... I thought maybe you could look at it and think of me. Hey, um, thank you for loving me, I mean. I know it doesn't exactly look good. A teacher and a student shouldn't have a relationship like ours. But this... this is the happiest I've ever been. Uh, that's enough serious stuff for one night. Let's get to the fun part. Oh, yikes. I was wondering what that was. It's really snowing a lot harder out there. I don't know if the trains can still run in this weather. Whoa, 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 down, boy. That's not happening. But I will hang around a little longer, at least. Just bear with me for now, okay? <sighs> I never thought I'd spend a quiet Christmas Eve with you. It feels like a dream. Well, we're both here, and we're both happy, so... For now, life's pretty good. Hey... I want to stay close for a little longer, do you mind?